here's what's coming up today on the program. The federal government has said it has executed more than 180 reforms aimed at making Nigeria a progressively better place to start and do business. According to the government, most of the 180 reforms were targeted at impacting the life cycle of micro, small and medium enterprises to ensure they perform better in the economy. Well, this is our focus in the first part of the show as we assess uh, this expected change, uh, the target, uh, targeted reforms are to bring on the Nigerian business landscape. Let's move on to equities market now. Nigeria's equities market on Wednesday is closed further in the red zone by 1.88%. The third consecutive decline this week over profit taking as market decreased by 2.24% month to date. We'll take a look at uh, factors driving this negative sentiment in a moment. And finally, on the program, oil fell on Thursday as weak U.S. economic data raised concerns of a potential global recession and demand reduction. Why Brent crude futures fell 74 cent in early trading, where Texas Intermediate's uh, crude slid 73 cent to set you at $84.25 and $79.88 a barrel uh, in that regard. All this and many more are some of the highlights on the show today. So let's take a break and when we return, of course, we'll take a look at uh, the stock market and the sentiment, of course, driving this uh, uh, negative uh, investor's appetite. We'll be back in a moment. Please stay with us.